Hi, I'm Jenna with the Cascade Employers Association and I want to talk about employee engagement surveys. And before I get into all of the different options that we have available for you, I thought it might be helpful to go through our approach to surveys to help you maybe understand some of the things that you might want to take a look at as you're considering um, an engagement survey. So one of the things that's really important is understanding what you're measuring. So in our surveys, we measure two things. We're looking at employee satisfaction and employee engagement. And it's important that you don't just look at satisfaction because that can create a little bit of a misleading picture. So when we're talking about satisfaction, we're looking at what's the employee getting from the organization. And so let's say someone, you know, they got to do online shopping all day and they think this is great. No one tells me not to. I get to do online shopping. This is fantastic. So they might have really high satisfaction, but if we were to look at their engagement, they might have really low engagement because they're probably not contributing a lot back to the organization. So that's why you wanna look at both because the engagement's really looking at that maximum alignment between job satisfaction, so what are they getting, and job contribution. What are they giving back to the organization? So when you're looking at surveys, you wanna make sure that you're looking at both of those pieces, satisfaction and engagement. Another thing to consider is, do you want an external glimpse in addition to your internal glimpse? So we offer both of those. And the reason why that's important is, you want to look at how are we doing internally across departments? How are they all performing? Or maybe you want to look at management, non-management. What are the differences uh, there? Where's their energy? Where are things needing a little bit of improvement? And so getting that internal glimpse is, of course, very, very um, important. And we can slice and dice your data in any way that's going to be meaningful to you. But you also want to take into consideration if you want sort of that market comparison, that norm comparison to other similar organizations. And I would argue it's really important, especially when we're in a challenging market where we have really low unemployment. It's very talent as well. So our surveys include that norm comparison so you can see how are we um, doing in work-life satisfaction or pay and benefits compared to the market out there, maybe compared to our um, you know, people that are in a similar industry. So really important to look at, do you want both of those? And of course our surveys include both that internal and that external uh, comparison. Another thing to take uh, into consideration when you're doing a survey is who you want doing it. So we often are acting as that third party administrator. And the reason why we're doing that is we want employees to have that trust and confidence in the process that no one from their company is going to see any individual survey or any individual results. And so with our surveys, we help you through the whole process. So we help make sure that you have all of the data and the subgroups that are gonna be the most meaningful to you. We handle all of the survey development, all of the survey administration, including pre-survey communications. So we'll go on site, meet with your employees to really help them understand who we are, what our role is, why they're doing the survey, answer any of the questions that they have, and really take them through the process and what to expect. We also let them know that, hey, we're the contact person. No one from your company is going to see any individual survey. The whole idea is that we want employees to trust the process so that they can be candid when they're providing that feedback. And also so that we get high response rates because, you know, it's not, it's not a great survey if you only get 30% of your employees that uh, respond. It's not going to be a very valid survey. So we spend a lot of time on that survey prep and development. And of course, when your survey is done, we give you a full data all of the data reports. We give you a full written analysis, including recommendations. And of course, we meet with your team to review everything and do some action uh, planning as well. So now that you understand our approach, let's talk about the different options that we have available. So our first option is the most comprehensive option. This includes 68 rated statements and three open-ended statements. So this covers 10 different categories of employment. So we're looking at everything from executive leadership effectiveness, supervisory effectiveness, pay, work-life satisfaction, organizational practices. It's very comprehensive. This is the survey that's recommended for your first engagement survey to really get that depth of information that you're after. 
The next survey option that we have basically cuts those number of statements in, in half, and it's a 35 statement uh, survey and still includes those open-ended questions. And the reason why we like the open-ended questions is because it gives us a lot of context to some of the rated statements. So there's a lot of good information that we get from those um, written comments that people have. So the 35 statement survey is best as a follow-up survey. So maybe last year you did a full comprehensive 68 statement survey. You want something that's a little bit narrower, but still covers those key drivers of engagement. That's gonna be the survey for you. Now, if you're looking for something that's not as comprehensive, you want a higher level look at your organization's performance and key drivers, and that's really it, then we have a 21 statement survey um, for you. And it also includes, again, those three um, open-ended statements. And so again, that's just for your higher level. We wanna do a quick check in uh, with employees on some pretty key areas. That's gonna be the best survey uh, for you. And so all of those surveys, you get both engagement and satisfaction uh, scores. The last survey option that we have available is a custom 15 statement survey. So this survey is ideal if you have a really specific area that you know you want some feedback on. So let's say you have spent the last couple of years really investing in um, developing your leaders and providing supervisory training and leadership training, and you want some really specific feedback on that, then a custom survey is probably going to be the best option for you. So our goal is with all of the different survey options that you have available, you have something that's going to um, meet your particular uh, needs. And of course, you can check out our website at cascadeemployers.com and learn a little bit more. Or you can email me at jreed at cascadeemployers.com to talk about what options might be best for you. And I'm going to leave you with one last little challenge. So the person who answers the following question first, so email me the first email response with that correct answer, I'm going to send you some Cascade swag. So the, qu the question is, what survey comes with your membership in Cascade? So the first one to respond with a correct answer is going to get some Cascade swag. So thank you for joining me and we'll talk to you soon.